Hello everyone, I'm Jonathan Wallen, and this is the fundamentals of a screenplay. That's Stewie behind me, you guys probably have seen him in other videos. Let's just get straight into it. So the first thing you need to do is establish where you are. And we do this by either writing exterior or interior in the top left corner, EXT or INT. EXT means exterior, which is outside. INT means interior, which is inside, like this office. So we go ahead, write interior or exterior, whichever one you want. I'm gonna do interior dot office, since I'm in an office. And now we know where we are, we need to know what time we're in this office. And right now it's, oh, it's almost, it's almost noon. So I'm gonna go noon, interior, office, noon. That's your first line. And that can be it, it can be that simple. Or if you wanna be more specific, you can write the time, uh, 11.30, 11.25, whichever one you want, as long as it serves a specific purpose. We know where we are, we know when we are, and we know we're inside. Now it's time to describe the scene. Uh, Stewie, do you want to describe the scene? Okay, so Stewie is sitting with his arms folded, deep in thought, hmm. wondering something. Okay, awesome. You can be just like that. Now we know where, we know when, we know it's inside, now we know what's happening in the scene. If you have characters in the scene, this is the time to put dialogue in. Okay, Stewie. I'm gonna use you again. Do you wanna say something? I wonder who is going to enter the arts competition next. Oh, that's beautiful, okay. So I'm gonna write that directly underneath his name. Now, if you've got another character in the scene that wants to reply to that, they go straight underneath Stewie's line. And then we're gonna write their dialogue. I'm gonna be me. And I'm going to say, I wonder, dot, dot, dot. It can be as simple as that. And you guys can go back and forth if you want. Or you guys can have dialogue directly next to each other. And that can be characters talking over the top of each other. That's something I found pretty cool as well. So we got the dialogue. We got the description. We got the time. We got the place. We know we're inside. Now, if you want to, you can add in color by adding in pauses, uh, beats, and... They can happen in the dialogue or in the description, whichever serves your story the best. What else we can do is add in transitions. Transitions happen on the right side of the page, and they are cut twos, cut to blacks, fade ins, fade outs, and that just adds in a little bit of spice, if you want to say, to your screenplay. And that is it. That is it. I'm here to help you. And I can't wait to read your work. I can't wait to see you guys at our event. Can't wait to see you guys at our showcase. And yeah, I catch you soon. <laughs> Bye.